Happy Thanksgiving, everyone, and indeed, we have some absolutely hilarious news today because things are turning out to be an absolute disaster for Disney once again over this Thanksgiving weekend. And this is something that I find to be absolutely amazing over the past few years is we get to watch Disney continue to decline time and time again over the holiday weekend. So this is something that Disney used to have a, a monopoly on in a way where they would have the power grab for Thanksgiving almost every year. And they would have something that would come out during Thanksgiving, and it would just completely dominate. There was nothing that would come close to touching it. But now, we live in a time where more people are turned off to Disney than ever before. We have Napoleon, Ridley Scott's historical epic, which is poised to defeat Disney's wish at domestic box office. That is absolutely insane. That this is where we're at. Napoleon is also being released on Apple as well. So it's crazy that Napoleon could potentially beat out Wish over this domestic box office weekend. Now the projections show that Wish is ultimately going to be the victor over this weekend. But I would absolutely love to see Napoleon destroy Wish. Now Napoleon is of course a film that I've heard very controversial things on. To say that it's a historical epic is uh, honestly probably not the right words. Because I hear that it's... Uh, Pretty historically inaccurate, unfortunately. But uh, all of that aside, I would love to see Napoleon beat Wish anyway, because F Disney at the end of the day. And there are a lot of people that just can't swallow this. There's a lot of woke media shills out there who just can't deal with the reality and the fact that Napoleon is already showing to have better uh, reviews on, on Rotten Tomatoes than Wish does, but also that it's going to potentially dominate in the box office as well. And so many people out there cannot deal with that news. Bob Box office Napoleon makes 3 million in previews, which follows with 2.3 million. And of course, uh, the Marvels is basically nowhere to be seen at this point in the box office already. And this is only its third weekend, which is absolutely amazing. But Disney is wishing upon a box office star this Thanksgiving as its latest animated movie, Wish, takes on Apple and Sony's historical drama Napoleon. Wish is expected to come out on top this weekend, but Napoleon won the first box office battle in previews. See how they're trying. Trying to just hope. They are wishing, literally wishing at this point, that Wish will beat out Napoleon, but we'll have to wait and see how that turns out. Napoleon made 3 million in previews, which began on Tuesday due to the Thanksgiving holiday, and Wish made 2.3 million. Now, I think there are probably a lot of families, or unfortunately, I don't know why, but there's probably a lot of families that will end up going to go see Wish, and that is going to definitely fluff up those numbers for Wish over this weekend. But the family friendly animated movie about Disney's iconic Wish wishing star is expected to make 35 million over the typical weekend which is just pathetic in itself this is a movie that is a that has like a 200 million dollar plus budget and it's only going to make 35 million in its opening weekend by the way this is not looking good for disney whatsoever they have yet another potential flop on their hands which is absolutely hilarious and i can't wait to see what continues to happen as disney continues to crash and burn as they they are doing with pretty much every film that that is being released at this point so with all of that being said let me know what you think is going to happen between napoleon and wish over this thanksgiving box office weekend which movie are you going to see hope you guys enjoyed and i'll talk to you all in another video very soon